Hello everybody. Okay, so just got finished shampooing my hair, blow drying, and trimming my ends. So trying to keep up with that. Uh, also, I'm trying a new product called Trina's Natural Hair Stimu Scalp Stim Stimulator. Goodness gracious. Um, so her whole story is that her daughter developed alopecia, and they tried a whole bunch of stuff. Went to the doctor prescribed some things and it, it grew back but then it fell back out so she did some research and she made her own um, scalp oil that helps her hair helps her daughter's hair grow back and, it, and she started seeing results in within six weeks um so I have my little spot that I told you about that but it's already grown back in so it grew back in before I even started this product um I can't find it but so I have my spot and it's no longer there because my hair is growing back and like I said I can't even find it right now. Um, but you don't have to actually have like alopecia or a bald spot to use this product. But it's supposed to be very good for um, stimulation or, hair, or growth stimulation. So I'm giving it a shot. So I just want to let you guys know about it so I will be back to show results or anything. So it says that you don't have to use a lot of oil. A little bit goes a long way. You can use it um, two times a day. I don't know if I'll use it that much, but we'll see. Um, so what I did was just went through my scalp like this, um, trying not to use a lot, and then I just massaged my scalp to get it all the way through. Um, so most likely if I don't use it once a day, I'll probably just end up using it once every time I shampoo my hair. So my results might be a little slower than if you were to use it every day. So I might try it every day. I'm not sure. I, I forget a lot of stuff. I like to set my hair and, and set it and leave it alone and not come back to it. Um, so I know it's been a while since I've been in front of this camera. Uh, so you can follow me on Instagram, which is under pretty dimples underscore zero one. And a lot of times I'll show my hairstyles and different things on there first before it gets to YouTube because YouTube is a whole big old thing. I sit down on a computer, edit, and all this other stuff. Instagram, instant. So if you want to follow me on there, that way you can get my hairstyles and things up quicker. And then eventually I will come around to getting it on YouTube. So right now I am going to do a style, of course. A style that, of course, I thought up in my head, and I'm hoping that it will be executed right. So I'm just sectioning off this middle section here in a horseshoe shape. Hope you see that. And then I'm just going to set this aside. And then I'm going to cut down the middle. Actually, no, I'm not. Um, I'm going to start here in the back, and I'm going to make a section going across here. And hopefully, my parts straight because I don't even have my second mirror. And then I'm going to put this away for now. Okay, and then I'm just going to split this in half. Put one side up for now. And then I'm using this um, Slick It Pomade. It's the same kind of texture as like um, edge control or edges or, you know, one of those thick, thick type of gels. I normally don't even like to use these types because they don't last um but I find when I braid with it it's a little it's a little bit better so I'm just going to braid this to the side
and then I'm going to take this side and put it away and I'm going to do the same thing. And so when I'm done with that, I'm just going to connect the two with a rubber band. Now I'm going to do another section going across. And this time I'm just going to put a little Echo Style Gel on it. And then just brush it into like a little ponytail. So I'm just alternating um, braids and no braids. <laughs> so my next section, I am going to braid it down. Okay, so now for each section that then made a ponytail, I'm going to split in two and just do a like a barrel curl. So I'm just going to take two fingers and roll it down. And it's going to take it into like a little, little curl. And I'm just going to pin it in. And I'm going to take the other one and do it the opposite way. Let me turn around and show you. And this last one, I'm just going to do one. And so for my middle, I haven't quite figured out what I'm going to do. But I'm going to put on some of this nothing but pure pudding got from Sally's. It's an okay product. I use it every once in a while. Um, nothing like, exciting or thrilling about it, but it's, it's a nice little product. Uh, so I think I'm just going to do bear curls with this too. So let me show you. So I'm going to take my two fingers and I'll secure it with two bobby pins.
And I think I'm going to do the bear crawl going forward for this top one. Hmm. Looks like them bangs back in the back in the 90s when you was a little girl. But I think I almost like it. So now I'm just going to go back and pin and make sure everything is set the way I like it. So that's my look. I did something similar to this a while ago, but um, this one has a little twist to it. I really like how the top part looks. So yeah, so I'll take pictures and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.